tuning in to the nonsense that Snoop Dad has caused. Um, it's all a show. It's for a show. It's been rehearsed. Um, basically, he's having people to kind of coach him on what he thinks going to work because he's determined to be famous. That's his main thing. So just to go ahead and cover some of the questions. Number one, Snoop's dad went to that grave on a just flute, you know, um, Pookie knew that we had a discussion about Snoop's headstone. Snoop does not have a headstone due to my personal reasons. Me as a mother is just some steps when you take taking this journey. It's just hard sometimes. And what I never wanted to accept is that Snoop is dead. And the hardest thing is to realize that he is never coming back. So that is the reason why he did not have a headstone is because it kind of sealed the deal for me. You know, we had this discussion before he went out there with his get along gang trying to basically just get attention because he had a, a conversation with someone else and they let him know that, hey, when it got time to bury uh, Snoop, there was no amount of money that was limited meek did not put a price on it you know and so he walked out there knowing the reason why there was not a headstone it has nothing to do with meek it's my personal um decision that i was not prepared and i actually spoke on doing that this year i talked to him about it and he was agreeing that hey we'll just go half on it and so going out to that grave and making that big old scene the main thing about it was that he wanted to go viral you know, he was excited about going viral. He thinks he's about to get paid for going viral. And so the people that's coaching him to do these things are just kind of making him feel like this is being successful by degrading me, which I don't care about the words that he say about me. Like, I'm not here to clear up anything as far as that. But the fact that my son's name is being tarnished for things as if, you know, he's not being taken care of at his grave site or I'm um, sorry about that. And so number two. Um, he's mentioned 50,000 times that I am a, a rat, okay? If you...